Annie had been studying for her master's in architecture for the past semester in Rome. I remember I was at work walking through the factory. I own a company called Sidekicks. We manufacture athletic shoes. Anyway, I remember how preoccupied I was that day. I'm sorry, Mr. Banks. My fault, Grace. Annie had never been that far away from home, and she was due back any minute. I couldn't wait to see the kid. George, she landed. My daughter had been studying abroad, been flying for 11 hours. I'm not wild about her being in the air. You have kids, Juan, you understand. It's, it's better when they're on the ground. I've always been a concerned parent. I'm big on car seats, seat belts, bedtimes, curfews, calling when you get somewhere, never running with a sharp object. What can I say? I'm a father. Worrying comes with the territory. Is Nina picking her up at the airport? Yeah. And you're yeah. going to meet him? Yeah, I'm, I'm going home right now. I, uh, oh. Here. And sign this. Okay. Oh. Okay, thanks. Now, oh. I left work early because I had a little something to pick up for Annie's homecoming. We live in a small town in Southern California called San Marino. I love this town, and not just because it's the kind of place where people still smile at each other, but because it hasn't changed much in the past 25 years. And since I'm not a guy who's big on change, this town fits me like a glove. I got Annie's 10-speed all cleaned up and polished. New seats, new tires. I couldn't wait to show it to her. This is our house, 24 Maple Drive. Annie was just in grammar school when we bought it. A few years later, we got a surprise package. Our son, Matt. I love this house. I love that I taught my kids to ride their bikes in the driveway. I love that I slept with them in tents in the backyard. I love that we carved our initials in the tree out front. This house is warm in the winter, cool in the summer, and looks spectacular with Christmas lights. It's a great house, and I never want to move. But the thing I think I like best about this house are the voices I hear when I walk through the door. <laughs>